Therefore, God, thy God, had anointed thee with what? Oil of gladness. Now, one of the things this anointing will do today, removing the shoulder of the burden on your neck, destroying the yokes around you. Another thing he wants to is anointed to destroy every form of wickedness. Family wickedness, wickedness of men against you. If there is anything they have cast against you, if there is anything they kept that is controlling your life by the reason of this anointing, and it, as it comes upon you today, whatever cloth you are wearing that is not your own, spiritually, the Lord will correct it. Yeah. He said that love righteousness and hate wickedness. Therefore, the Lord thy God has anointed thee with oil of gladness oil of testimony now whatever what it means is that every form of wickedness that have resisted you not to manifest as god have ordained you to be now the first question you ask yourself every human being here is that the way i am now is it how god have ordained my life if i am doing well is it exactly the way i supposed to be doing well or something has happened was there anything changed anywhere and if it's not, this anointing is for you. Any area of your life, both in your health, your career, your family, things are not working. By the reason of this anointing. And now hear this. Even if there is no form of wickedness around you, as you receive this anointing, if anybody back on any wickedness against you, it will backfire. that love and righteousness and hated wickedness. He said this oil is oil of gladness. Oil to restore back your joy. Anointing flow in my life. Cover oh, my, my head to toe. I need your power oh, to do your will. Oh Lord, Lord I pray. Lord, I pray. Let it come upon me. Let it take it personal. The way you understand it determines what happens. Anointing flow in my life. Cover oh my, my head to toe. I need your power to do your will. Oh Lord, I pray. Lord, I pray. When this oil enter in a place where there is pollution there is going to be divine intervention Amen. yes there was one particular that was on deliverance I bring a bottle of oil the young girl refused that I cannot pour that oil he's not her but what is inside of her refused that this oil cannot touch this head and after much we subdue her and the oil touched God told me put this oil at the center of her head and I declared the word of God and dropped the oil upon the center of her head. She screamed and slept off. Deliverance came. So this oil today, if there is anything inside of you, you must tell yourself, this is the opportunity I'm waiting for. I know a man in this house, when they newly come to this church, one of the days I called him out. Yeah, they, I called him out. I said, okay, how many children do you have? He said, none. We have been waiting for. I said, okay. What was the doctor's report? He said, I have been treating infection. Infection that have refused to go. The infection refused to go. He said, I'm tired of treating. And I said, buy anointing oil. You have seen me in this house. Most of I said, get oil. And after prayer, things happen. And he brought the oil. A small bottle of anointing oil. I prayed on it. I said, you and your wife pray in this way drink from it and i told god that thing medicine cannot do doctor cannot do do it through this anointing oil and they used it and came back i concluded the prayer today they have a boy and a girl the yoke was broken i don't know what the enemy planted let me tell you you see sickness that is demonic spiritual spell against you no matter the drugs you take it doesn't respond i've seen it in this house and at last you see that medicine you spend a lot of money spend go here go here just giving you small oil use it put it in your mouth you come out and discover that everything has finished even go back to doctor doctor who said nothing is there 
whatever God did not plant in your life in the name of Jesus, as you turn that amen, that thing is getting down. Yeah. There's a lady I saw this week. And uh, she now, while I was talking to her, he said, you know, to recognize me. I said, who? She mentioned the name of her sister. He said, because you know that mentioning the name of her sister, I will remember. What happened? The sister had a terrible case. What was the case? She was HIV positive. In fact, the thing has come to the, you know, that HIV issue have levels. Am I correct? It develops. Those of you who are medical personnel understand what I mean. At the first stage, it may not be that serious, but the last stage is very dangerous. That's where it kills. When medications are not taken, you, don't under, you didn't know, and it takes you unaware. It can destroy. So that girl now have gotten to that level. Though she was aware, but she refused to take the medication. And the thing started dealing with her. She was going down. At that time, she just be like pain. One day she went to gather, wanted to take something to destroy her life. He said, instead of dying small, small, let me just die once. She carried her medicine. According to what she told me when they brought her to me, he said, when she wanted to put it in her mouth, he heard a voice. He said, I'm a God of second chance. Go and meet social pastor. He can help you. And he'll come out of this. He said, that was the voice he heard. That God said, he should come and meet me. And the, she told the family, they now brought her to me. So I started administration. Every day I give her anointing oil. She did that prayer that three weeks. But we, I discovered at the time when we were doing that prayer, she started recovering. So after the prayers, the Lord told me that this matter is resolved. I didn't want to say with my mouth. I said, okay, you go and check the test again. Let's see what is there. And she went and checked. It was negative. I'm telling you. Did you know after that prayer she recovered full her wrist stature came back after her recovery not up to two years a man came for marriage whether he did one year or less up at least one year her marriage and you know for marriage you must run that test so when the Lord said you have destroyed the juju that is guiding this house with the anointing oil and the juju now 68,000, you go pay. Oh, it was a serious issue. That time, oh, he said the juju, the cost of juju, they brought it in three places, saying at 68,000 that she will pay. You pour anointing oil, you know, but he said, I'm not going to lie. We pray, they pray, say, may we pour for our domot, that whatever that is following us, he said, that you pour oil for my house. He said, you don't destroy the juju that is guiding the house. And the, the landlord she do meeting, call his family members and told her, say, bring your own family. Let them hear what happened because you have spoiled my thing and you go pay. So she came to me before the day of the meeting. He said, Pastor, see the one I did now. I said, did the landlord say you should make you come out? He said, no. He said, you go pay. Even if you, go, you, go, even if you are leaving, you must pay first. He said, how can I not pay for juju? Me, who don't serve juju? How will I not pay for juju? So she now asked me. He said, they put the, the meeting on social day. What am I going to do? I said, okay, I will borrow your wisdom. And I prayed. And what I told her, I said, if they say everything they have said, need down for the old man, tell her, say, pa, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I didn't know. But if they insist you will pay, tell them that the day we pray for that anointing oil, I prayed for your money. That anybody who use your money, not even you, nobody, not even you yourself is permitted to use your money to do juju. And if anybody do that on your behalf or anyhow, each one naira will collect one head. Did you hear the prayer? Each one naira, one person will go down. So, tell them, say, that is a prayer because if this anointing spoils this kind of thing, I don't know how it will be. If they now say you should give them 68,000, that's say somebody has signed that one and somewhere. In Jesus' name, let your amen be loud. Now listen, we are moving into the anointing immediately. 
Listen. There was a man one day they brought to me. It was the sister of that man that brought him. This man lives he lived in Europe for more than 10 years or close to 15 years. Let me use that word. He has documents. He was doing well. And he has a sister of, what I say, the same mother. Or bro, the same mother with a mother. Live the same country. He said that his sister, from the day he himself entered Europe, the woman was not happy. But he noticed that the wicked, the, her anger was increasing at the time. The woman told her, said, I don't know how you take, enter this country. He said, but you will go back. Are you listening to what I'm saying? I asked him, you have, do you offend him? He said, somebody he, he respects so much that is older than him. He said, but he told him, from the day he saw him in Europe, it was like, how did you get here? And he himself is a type who don't know God. Listen, oh. Because we want to pray before I bless this oil now. He didn't understand. He said the woman, anytime they pass, he said at the time he started avoiding her. But by mistake, the jam, he goes shout, give her. Say he goes soon go back. Are you saying himself has document? He's doing well. But he said, if you didn't stop me to get document, I'll be told your wickedness. Hear me, devil, no, they get tired. Out. They are done born. No be answer. Tell God to protect the children. Even as the children grow, let them be better for you. Even as they get to the level of progressing. Because the devil don't soon easily give up. That's what the Bible said. Right from the days of John the Baptist, now the kingdom suffering violence. Only the violent take it what? By force. Please, in this service of these seven weeks, pray like you never prayed before. Right in my office. You know, these are some of the things that made me, I don't like doing the counseling in my office. In the other outside. While he was talking, the Lord told me that that woman is a witchcraft. Who tried to control everyone around her. Hear me. If there's anyone controlling your God, controlling your children, today you are breaking out of it. Shout the Father. No man born of a woman can control my life. The life of my children. Shall the Father. Any evil control they are using to control my life. Shall the break seven times. Open your mouth and pray. Not to me, not to my children. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, hear me. That's where I center my prayer today. We are going to take that prayer in different three dimensions after when I bless this oil. Lord, I bless this oil. I declare it oil of total freedom. Lord, everyone that dip their hand to touch this oil, let it come upon them like a mighty power. Like a rushing wind upon their head. To you and everyone that connected to you as a man, as a woman, to your children, Lord, let this oil carry power. Let this oil contact fire. Let everyone that receive this oil today manifest their real destiny. Whatever inside of them covering God's destiny in their life, let that thing expire by fire. In the name of God the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. Put him very strong and very loud. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. Oh my soul. Worship his soul. Live Sing like never before Oh my soul Worship his soul me Bless the Lord Oh my soul Oh my soul Oh my soul Worship Worship his soul Rise. 
Shall the Father? In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. I've received the anointing. I believe in the manifestation. Holy Ghost. Search me now. Anything inside of me. Contrary to the word of God. Come out by fire. Sickness. Premature death. Rising and falling. Delay. What are you waiting for? Go back to your sender. Or you are praying. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now shout it, evil cage. Evil cage. Covering me spiritually. Covering me spiritually. In, the In the name of Jesus. Pray. Yeah. Oh yeah, pray. Pray right now. Evil cage. Let your voice be very strong, very loud. Untimely death, premature death, rising and falling. Whatever inside of me, whatever covering me that I cannot burn. Every spirit of premature death, wherever they are calling my name. Get out! Something is jumping out. Something is jumping out. Usher, oh, watching the power of God is moving right now. Every attack in the night, oppression in the night. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Lift up those hands. Or shall watch it. Shout the Father. Anything following me from any strange altar. Go back to your sender. Shout the Father. Let your fire rest upon me now. From my head to the sole of my feet. Anything inside of me, contrary to your word, jump out. Go back to your sender. Jump out. Go back to your sender. Pray that prayer right now. Now God that answer by fire, it will be my God. God answer by fire, it will be my God. Now God that answer by fire, it will be my God. Now God that answer by fire, it will be my God. Now God that answer by fire, it will be my God. Now God that answer by fire. Let God the answer by fire, oh, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire, oh, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire, you will be my God. Let God the answer by fire. Of those hands, close down your eyes right now. Whatever that connected you to your father's house, whatever holding you, dragging you back from your father's house, somebody shout that name Jesus three times louder. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, I watch it. Whatever connected you to any river, whatever connected you to untimely death, whatever connected you to delay, whatever you are seeing in your dream that is holding you. Somebody shot fire seven times. Fire, 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 fire. Uh -huh. watch it. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, let Abada 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 Abada. Osha, help me. Osha, help me. The power of God is here. Losing you. Any connection with any river. Any connection with your timely death. Premature death. Osha, carry them out. Get out. Jump out. Jump out. Jump out. 
Jesus Christ. Anything inside of me now, contrary to your word, anything inside of me now, as a result of people's wickedness, in the name of Jesus, as I command fire, flush out of my life, flush out of my destiny, flush out of my business, flush, flush out of my career. Seven times in the name of Jesus. Fire. Fire. Place that two hands on your head. Quiet everywhere right now. Lord, whatever they are carrying, poison, moving object, hotness of the body. Strange dreams. At the count of three, I command that storm to end. 
One, two, three. One, two, three. Stretch your hand toward this altar. I pronounce you free. Sweat that hand. I hear God say, show me. There's somebody here, somebody calls you and say, no matter how you pray, nothing break. Oh my God. There is somebody here, a woman naked herself at the junction and calls your mother children. Uh, that, 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 I place my hand on this altar at the count of three. We are about that cause is ready. We are about that cause is existing. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. God shall help me. God shall help me. I stand on this altar. I pray for somebody. Stretch your hand toward this altar. Ha, yeah, 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 yeah. Anybody for your family where they follow people spiritually. Any woman in your family that have turned to monitor this spirit. In the name of Jesus, at the count of three, I break her power. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Separate her. Stretch your hand. Anywhere they kept your glory, shout my father, my maker. My father, my maker. Every of my stolen glory. Return now by fire. Return. 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 Something is happening there. In Jesus' name, place that two hands on your head. I command anything that looks like sickness, untimely death. Sickness, untimely death. In your life, in your family, your marriage. As you turn that amen three times, be free. Just go back on your knee again. Say, Father, I can see it. I represent myself, my own children, my mother's children. Today, by this little seed on the altar, oh Lord, preserve us from every hands of the wicked. Preserve us this year. Protect us from every, every danger. Protect us from every danger and traps of the wicked this year 2023 can I hear amen to that amen. now shall the father let the seed become a voice speak against anything or any evil sacrifices raise against me my siblings and everyone connected to me in any form I nullify it in Jesus name put amen three times now confess this one very loud and clear say Lord beautify me this year let people see me and see your glory shall the oh Lord give me Charlie, oh Lord, oh Lord. Give, me give me testimony. Give me surprises. Give me, surprises. Give me results give me that will terminate in salt. I receive it. I believe it. From today, let it manifest out in the name of Jesus. Now rise on your feet. Thunder that amen seven times. Now stretch your hand. If you shout amen, angel come morning, visit your hand this way. Those on evil mission to make you cry. As you turn that amen, they will cry your cry. Some are sitting down. I wish you can stand at this junction. Let me release you. 
Stretch your hand. I, I repeat again. Stretch your hand toward this altar. Your week is blessed. Amen. This week you will not return empty. Amen. Whoever bless you shall be blessed. Amen. Whoever that costs you, the cost will return back. Amen. If anybody in back on evil journey because of you, they will travel, they will not return. The door of your business is open. Yeah. Financial door is open. Yeah. Healing is your portion. Yeah. Deliverance is your portion. Yeah. Where is the Lord God of Remite? Yeah. Where is the Lord God of Remite? Yeah. Where is that God that answer by fire? Yeah. Prove yourself and manifest your power. In Jesus' name. Yeah. Another. Yeah. The loudest. Yeah. May we share the grace in fellowship. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God. And the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Rest and abide with us. Surely. Forever and ever. Go and may the Lord bless you. Shalom.